The personality changes in a kind of curse over any dog can be based on individual temperament, genetics, and environmental factors. However, there are some general trends that you might observe as your kind of curse progresses from puppyhood to adolescence to middle age and into their senior years. Shout out your dog in the comments and let us know how old they are and your favorite trait they displayed at a certain age. And do us a huge favor by subscribing. I feel like we give a lot of free helpful advice on this channel when it comes to raising your dog, raw diet help, health related information, and I know a lot of the info we provide can help you and your canine companion out in one way or another. Canine Corsa puppies are typically full of energy and they love to play. When Bruce and Justice were very young, Connie Corsa puppies, these energy spurts came in waves. They'd have a ton of energy one minute running around, playing, and then the next minute they're just wiped out going to sleep. And you're gonna see this pretty much along all dog breeds across the board. Connie Corsa puppies are gonna be very curious and explorative. They're gonna wanna put things in their mouth. They're gonna wanna test things out with their paws. Dogs only have a certain way to sense things. They can see, they can smell, but they don't have hands, so they like to put things in their mouth. Let your Kane Corsa puppy explore the world, but also monitor them so they're not eating things that could hurt them, like putting a rock and swallowing it in their mouth, for example. You may get puppy tantrums where you have literally done everything you can think of to satisfy your Kane Corsa puppy's needs, such as food, water, play, rest, love, but they still have these crazy outbursts. And that's very common and the best thing to do is to be patient and do not give in to their demands. A kind of course of puppies very eager to please you as their leader. So that makes them highly trainable and very easy to train. So definitely use this to your advantage when training your Kanae Corsa puppy at this age. Do not expect your Kanae Corsa puppy to show any of the natural guardian instincts that they typically do as an adult at this age. I'm personally a huge advocate of socialization, especially throughout puppyhood, especially those first 12 weeks of puppyhood. It's so crucial in your dog's development. And it's gonna help them grow into well-adjusted adults by socializing them at an early age. It allows their minds to grow and expand just through your guidance, showing them the world outside of these four walls that we have around us. I just also must make a point to call out that I'm still constantly socializing my dogs, even as they're adults. And this is something I continue to practice throughout their entire life. And I'm going to even through senior years because socialization is a skill. And any skill that you stop doing, you lose that skill. Any skill that you practice, you become better at that skill. So just always be socializing your dog. It goes so far for their well being. Adolescence, which is six months ish to about three years when they hit maturity. And these can be some of the most trying times in raising your Kanye Corso. It may feel like your dog has unlearned all of the training you have done. This is because they're pushing the limit at this age. This is also where Bruce Wayne and Joey Justice have differed quite a bit. Bruce mentally matured much faster than Justice. Justice still has so much puppy in him at just over a little bit of two years of age, where Bruce lost that puppiness by about a year and a half, but also the dynamic in the house is different because we only had one dog, we only had Bruce. I feel like Justice is like, I don't need to grow up, I got my big bro. With many kind of courses, this is the age they really start testing those boundaries. It's very common among all breeds, so don't think it's something you're doing wrong in your training, but with a kind of course it comes extra responsibility because of how large and powerful they are. So it's very important you're constantly working on their obedience, their house manners, and just raising them properly. There's so many things to do when you're training your kind of course to raise them properly, and I know it can feel extremely overwhelming, and that's a normal feeling to have because as pet parents, we wanna do right by our dogs. But with confusion comes mistakes and a kind of course is not a breed you want to make mistakes with when training them. I'm going to link in the description box some online training courses put out by the Will Atherton Academy. We have everything from puppy training courses to more advanced obedience training courses that are just going to guide you every step of the way, helping you create that perfect canine companion you've always wanted. There's some courses in there that I myself did, such as the raw feeding course and the ultimate breed Kane Corso. Use code Jason to get 10% off and also help support the channel. And through adolescence, you're going to start to see increased independence where they're not as needy they don't need you by their side every second you may find that they want to be outside longer than normal and they're just comfortable just hanging out in the yard laying in the sun not needing you there with them all the time this is the age where consistency is extremely important reinforcing positive behavior is crucial at every stage but even more so through adolescence and just a reminder continued socialization it's important to maintain socialization to ensure they develop good behavior with people and animals even through this age and through adulthood and senior years Adulthood is typically around three to five years of age. I feel Bruce Wayne hit maturity around three and a half. 
Justice is already way behind Bruce in his mental development. He's developing much slower. He's very smart, very obedient, but he's still very much puppyish. So I, f I feel like it's gonna be at least three and a half till he's fully mentally mature. Through adolescence, your Kane Koros's protective instincts are going to start to develop. They may become more protective of their family and their territory, like their yard or even your neighbor's yard. Bruce Wayne started showing his protective instincts around 18 months of age, and Justice is a little bit over two, and he's just now showing those protective instincts. And I actually have a security cam of Justice scaring the crap out of the Amazon delivery driver. I'll throw that up on my Instagram for you guys to see. And we have a neighbor pulling in right now. Justice is observing. He's looking at a bird. He's so observant. You are so observant, bro. A good rule of thumb I follow is correct any unwanted behavior with your dogs and praise every wanted behavior that your dogs display, even if it's not asked through you. Kind of course is an extremely loyal breed and you're gonna see it through their entire life. This is the age where they really become extremely loyal. They develop an even stronger bond with their humans and they really exhibit that loyalty. They've always been loving and cuddly with us, but around two, is when they both really started to even more so develop this behavior. This is where Akane Corso starts to care less about people around them and more about their own people. They don't need to meet every single person in the world that they see. And around adulthood, your Kanai Corso may become more settled and less prone to impulsive behavior. Um, by now, you should be able to read your Kanai Corso and know how they're gonna react before they even react. Middle age, which is Bruce right now, is six to nine years old, I would say. And this is where some potential health concerns could arise, some age-related health issues. Um, so you always just remember just regular veterinarian checkups just to make sure you're on top of everything. Middle age is where you're gonna see reduced energy. Expect a decrease in overall energy levels and activity in general. This doesn't mean that your dog does not need or want to go on walks and play and need exercise, but you just may need to possibly back off and listen to what your content course is telling you. I'll use Bruce Wayne for an example. He is seven months old next month in March. He loves walks, he loves to play, but I've noticed if he has like a big day, a big outing with a lot of activity, even a lot of social interaction, he needs like a day off to recoup and recover. So basically, you just need to be able to listen to what your Kane Corso is telling you. By this age, you should be fully bonded with your dog and fully understand what they're trying to tell you. In middle age, you may even find your Kane Corso becoming even more affectionate than they already are. Both these dogs are very affectionate. Past six months or so, Bruce has just been even more affectionate than normal. This happens a lot with dogs when they get older. They just naturally become more affectionate. Kanye Corso seniors, nine to 10 plus years. By this age, you'll definitely have noticed your Kanye Corso slow down a lot. They're gonna be very content laying around the house by your side looking over things, but don't be fooled. They'll quickly pounce into action if they need to. But they probably won't be as reactive to everything as they once were when they were younger. They're just much more filled with wisdom now. Another thing with senior years and with age, becomes the slowing down of learning new things. Like the old adage says, you can't teach an old dog new tricks. Well, that might not be true, but there is some truth behind it and it's going to take them longer to learn something new versus when they're very young and their brains are like sponges just absorbing all of this information and learning so quickly. Just like humans, it's much easier to learn as a child versus an adult. Senior dogs may face health challenges such as arthritis, hearing loss, vision problems, and some of these changes will lead to behavior changes. So always be in tune with what your dog's telling you. Despite their age, their love and companionship continues on. Long live the Kane Corso, the ultimate dog breed, in my opinion, the best dog breed in the world. And until next time, Bruce Wayne, Joey Justice, and myself, we'll see you later. Peace. Okay. I don't know where they're going, but they're going somewhere. Oh, he comes over to play. Justice, come here. You can play over here, buddy. You can play over here. Show me your toy. Yeah, that's your toy. Go get him. Go play with Justice. Go see Justice. Do I need to put a lob mic on you? What's he doing? What's he doing? What's he doing? What's he doing? <laughs> Still likes to play. 
You just got smacked with the tail. You got smacked with the tail on your face. You got smacked with the tail on your face. What's he doing? Go get him. Go get him. Thanks for watching, guys.